Your GPU might be ready, but your CPU is holding you back. If you're struggling with stutters, 100% CPU usage, or uneven frame pacing, chances are Windows is silently throttling or mismanaging your CPU resources. These nine Windows tweaks unlock hidden CPU performance by removing system bottlenecks and prioritizing your gaming workload, all without risking stability or complicated overclocking. 1. Disable Dynamic Ticking Command Prompt Dynamic ticking is a Windows feature designed to save power by skipping CPU timer interrupts during idle periods. While this improves battery life and energy efficiency on laptops, it can introduce input lag, jitter, and inconsistent frame pacing in fast-paced games or apps that require precise timing. How to disable. Open Command Prompt as Administrator. Right-click Start, Arrow, Command Prompt as Admin. Type the following command and press Enter bcd edit slash set slash disable dynamic tick yes restart your pc to apply changes disabling dynamic ticking forces the cpu to maintain regular timer interrupts which reduces micro stutters and input lag during gaming to revert if you find any stability or power issues after disabling revert with bcd edit slash delete value slash disable dynamic tick. 2. Set system responsiveness to gaming mode. Registry. By default, Windows allocates some CPU time slices to background tasks to keep the system responsive overall. This means active foreground apps, like your game, sometimes compete for CPU resources with background processes like updates, indexing, or telemetry. You can optimize for gaming by telling Windows to give maximum scheduling priority to active programs, reducing latency, and boosting frame rates. How to tweak? Open Registry Editor, R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Navigate to Find or create a D-word value called System Responsiveness. Set the value to 0, 0. This tells Windows to minimize background task CPU usage and prioritize the foreground process, your game. This tweak is especially effective for CPU-heavy games, where every millisecond counts. 3. Disable Power Throttling Registry Modern CPUs, even high-end ones, are designed to scale down their power consumption and performance when Windows thinks it can save energy. This feature is called power throttling. While it helps with battery life on laptops and reduces heat, it's not ideal for gaming or performance-heavy tasks. Why? Because it can suddenly cut CPU power during a game causing stutters, FPS dips, and inconsistent responsiveness, especially on CPUs with many efficiency cores. This tweak ensures your processor stays ready at full performance without interference from power-saving algorithms. How to disable power throttling completely? Open Registry Editor. Press Windows plus R, type RegEdit, and hit Enter. Navigate to the key Modify or create the D word. Type power throttling off. Set the value to 1. Reboot your PC for the change to take full effect. By setting power throttling off equals 1, you tell Windows to stop dynamically scaling down CPU performance. 4. Unpark all CPU cores. Optional tool, park control. Windows parks CPU cores to save energy, which means it turns off or lowers the frequency of some cores when idle. The problem, it's often too aggressive and causes frame drops and micro stutters during sudden CPU load spikes like gaming or video editing. How to fix? Use the free park control tool from Bitsum. It's safe and user-friendly. Set the power profile to Bitsum highest performance. This automatically disables core parking and frequency scaling. 
Alternatively, you can edit registry keys manually to unpark cores, but park control is much faster and safer for most users. Unparking cores means your CPU cores stay ready and running at max speed when the game demands it, reducing lag spikes. 5. Launch games with high CPU priority shortcut method. Windows assign CPU priorities dynamically, but the task manager's set priority only lasts until you close the game. To make sure your game always gets highest CPU priority when launched, create a shortcut that forces this behavior automatically. Steps. Open Notepad. Paste the following, replacing the path with your game's executable. Save the file as launchgame.bat on your desktop. Use this batch file to launch your game with elevated priority. This prevents other background tasks from stealing CPU cycles during gameplay and reduces frame drops caused by system interruptions. 6. Disable SysMain, formerly called Superfetch, is designed to preload frequently used apps into RAM for faster loading. However, it can cause high CPU and disk usage spikes, especially on systems with HDDs or lower-end SSDs, resulting in stutters and lag. How to disable? Press Win plus R, type services.msc, and hit Enter. Scroll to SysMain, right-click, Properties, set Startup Type to Disabled. Click Stop to halt the service immediately. Disabling SysMain reduces background CPU and disk I.O., allowing your system to focus resources on gaming. 7. Remove scheduled tasks that spike CPU. Windows runs many scheduled tasks for telemetry, diagnostics, and user experience improvements. These often fire randomly and cause noticeable CPU spikes during gaming sessions. Tasks to disable in Task Scheduler Office Office Telemetry Consolidator Customer Experience Improvement Program Application Experience slash AIT Agent How to disable? Open Task Scheduler TaskCHD.msc Browse to each task and right-click Disable this helps your system avoid surprise CPU usage spikes that interfere with smooth gameplay. 8. Disable Game Explorer and Indexing for Games Folder Windows Game Explorer constantly scans and indexes game files, adding unnecessary CPU and disk overhead. You can stop this by disabling indexing on game folders and removing Game Explorer entries. Steps are Navigate to your main game folders, right-click Folder, Properties, and uncheck Allow files on this drive to have contents indexed in addition to file properties. This reduces background scanning and prevents needless CPU usage while gaming. 9. Disable CPU Interrupt Moderation Interrupt moderation bundles and delays hardware interrupts to reduce CPU usage in general tasks. However, in gaming or latency-sensitive workloads, it can add input lag and cause stuttering. How to disable interrupt moderation for your network adapter? Open Device Manager. Expand Network Adapters and right-click your active adapter. Select Properties, Advanced tab, Find Interrupt Moderation or Similar in the list. Set it to Disabled. Click OK and restart your PC. This tweak reduces latency caused by delayed interrupts, allowing your CPU to respond faster to network events, which is especially helpful in online gaming or streaming. Outro. Fixing your CPU bottleneck is rarely about pushing clocks higher or buying new hardware. Most often, it's about eliminating hidden slowdowns and inefficient default Windows settings that throttle or mismanage your CPU resources. Try these nine tweaks, especially disabling dynamic ticking, unparking cores with park control, and launching games with high CPU priority, and you'll unlock much smoother, more responsive gameplay without any risk of breaking your system.
If you want a full CPU plus GPU combo tweak pack or personalized advice, just drop a comment. We're always crafting the latest optimization guides.